In this video, I'm going to show you how to build a full website in 10 minutes or less. After watching this video, you'll be able to create a website just like this and you don't need to go to school for this and you don't need to learn coding. All you simply need to do is click the link that's in the description of this video and it's going to bring you to this page right here where it's going to ask you to simply register. So all you have to do is just enter your name and email address and then password. And make sure to click here where it says I am not a robot and then you click on submit. Next it will bring you to this page here where it's going to ask you to choose a template. And as you can see there are templates that are already created for you. So you just simply need to choose a template and then you'll be able to build your website from that. So you can set up a website, an online store, landing pages or funnels. And if you look here to your left you'll see the different types of templates that you are able to use or you can actually create one from scratch. If you move your mouse over any template, you will notice here where it says preview. If you just click on preview, you'll be able to see what the template looks like. You can just scroll down to see what the template looks like on a desktop. If you change here, you can see what it looks like on an iPad and you can change here, you see what it will look like on a phone. I'm just going to quickly click here where it says real estate and then I'm just going to choose one of the templates that I can use for a real estate business. I'm just going to click on this one and then I'm just going to name this Malawa Real Estate. Once I'm done, I just click on Submit. And then automatically the software is going to start building your website for you. You don't need to build the website from scratch, but it will actually set it up for you. One thing that I love about this particular software is that it will show you step by step what you need to do. So for everything that you're going to try and do, it will always give you a video where it's just going to explain how to actually set up the website. For example, this video here, I can just simply click on play and it's going to explain to me how I can just begin to edit my website. But I'm just going to close that. And basically, this is what my website looks like. I can just scroll down and I can see the different images and the details that I can have on my website. So what you will begin to do is that you can just simply come in here and just simply edit everything that is in here. For example, the first thing that I can edit is just by editing the name or the logo of my website. I can just simply click here where it says houses and I can just click on that wheel there and then it's going to ask me whether I want to use an image logo or I want to use a text logo. If I want to use an image logo, I can just simply highlight on that and then click this plus here to locate the, the logo on my desktop and then I'll upload it here. But for now, I'm just going to click on where it says text logo and I'm just going to simply click in here and then I'm going to delete everything that's in there and just simply start typing the name of my business. So as you can see, I've called it Malaba Real Estate. And if I want to edit the font, I can just simply click here and then I can change the font to whatever font I want to use. I need to make sure that all the text is highlighted and then I can change the font to whatever font I want to use like that. And I can also change the size of the font, maybe make it smaller. I can also make it bolder, just like that. Now, if I want to change the color of the button, I can just simply click on the button and then I click on where it says edit styling. And then I'm able to then come and change the colors here. For example, it says button color there. I can click on that. I usually like using red for my buttons. So I'll just click on that red there. Click out there and then border color. I can click on that and then change it to red also. As you can see, the button color has changed there. Then if I want to change what the text says in that button, I can just simply click on the button again. And then I click where it says edit. And then in this section here, this is where I can change. I can maybe just highlight this and say view properties. And then as you can see, it's changed there. And also just to mention every single time when you are making any changes, you just want to make sure that you click here where it says save at the top so that all the changes that you make will be saved. And then if you scroll down, you can go in here again and make changes to everything that you see. For example, if I want to edit this image, I can just simply click on the image and then click where it says edit image. And then I just simply click this plus here. And then I can click here where it says upload a file. And then I can simply locate the file on my computer. I can choose this one to just load up. And then I just need to make, then I just simply need to click on the image and then say select. 
And then as you can see, the image automatically changes. And once again, I'm just gonna click on save changes. So that's how you're gonna be editing the website. You'll be able to edit anything on the website. You can change text just by simply clicking on the text and then editing it. You can change images by clicking on the image and editing the images. You will also notice right here at the top that you are given different menu options that you can use. If you want to add a new menu option, and then you can click here where it says add menu item, and then you can add a new menu to the menu that's already existing. Or if you want to edit, for example, I wanna change this to about us, I can just simply click here where it says about, and then I can add the words us. And as you can see, it changes on the website and I just simply need to click on save changes. If I want to edit the about us page, I can just simply click there on about us and then automatically it's going to open the about us page and then I can follow the same plan of just going in and just simply changing the text, changing the images and changing everything that I want to change. Now it's actually that simple and easy and the more that you just play around with this software, you'll be able to test it and you'll be able to learn how to use it and you'll be able to do practically anything when it comes to building websites. Now one great feature that you need to know about this tool is that it's got what's called an academy. And if you click on this option right here at the top where it says academy, you will find different lessons that you can watch that will basically teach you how to use the software. For example, how to create a website, how to create a funnel, how to create emails and automations, uh, quizzes and surveys. It actually also gives you like um, website design tips, how to create memberships, how to sell courses. It will teach you everything that you need to know about how to use the software and how to actually build websites. Now, let's say that I have actually made changes to the website and I'm happy and I want to view and see what it actually is going to look like. I can just come here where there's this eye here and click on that where it says website preview. And then it's basically going to show me what the website looks like. This is exactly how the website is going to look like when it's finished. And then as you can see here, you can change the view to tablet. You can change the view also to mobile view. This is what the website will look like when someone is viewing it on the mobile and then if I like it I can save it if I want to make a few changes I can then make some changes now you notice here at the bottom it says start your free trial basically what this means is that when you're using the software you are able to set it up for free you are you've been given a, a 14 day free trial so if you click on that it's going to bring you to a page where it actually shows the actual pricing of the software and currently on the market, this is the most affordable, this is the best software that you will find that you can actually build uh, websites. And as you can see, they've got different packages. You can choose the yearly packages or the monthly packages. And you can start off with the lowest package there. As you can see, it's $39 per month. That's if you pay uh, for the whole year, or if you just change this to monthly, you'll be able to see that you'll just be paying $49 per month. Now, traditionally, what would happen with websites is that websites were normally built with coding. So you would get someone who is able to do coding and they would set up the website for you. It usually take them a couple of months to build the website and then you have it. And then um, it usually costs a lot of money. And every single time you need changes, you would need to contact that person and they would then be the one who make changes because basically you wouldn't know how to do coding. But now using this particular software, you'll be able to make changes any time that you want. And that's why it's a membership based um product like this that allows you to be able to just go in there, edit anything that you want, add new images, add new products, just basically as if like you're updating your social media, you'll be able to update your website. And that's why this is so unique and it's so great. So to set up the website, like I showed you, it's gonna be for free. It's not gonna ask you to actually add your credit card details or anything. But when you want the website to go live and you don't want that option that was appearing at the bottom, which says start free trial, you want your website to actually, for people to start finding it actually and start using it, that's when you're gonna to have to choose one of these packages here. Now, the other thing that you also want to have is a domain name. If I click here where it says show a new tab, it's going to show me my website. As you can see, it's appearing as malabatechmedia.creatorhq.com. If I want to change this to my own personal name, for example, Malaba Real Estate, so that people will be able to find me easier, what you need to do is that you just simply need to come here where there's this wheel here where it says website settings. You click on that and then you come here where it says domains. 
and then here you're going to connect an existing domain in other words you're going to need to buy your domain name first and then you're going to have to connect it here for example i can if i bought my domain name it's going to be um, malabarealestate.com and then i'm just going to click on connect here and once you have done that another video is going to pop up again which will basically explain to you the few more steps that you need to take. And they're simple and easy. And just by you following the instructions, you'll be able to set up your website. And like I mentioned earlier on, there's also the Academy feature there that um, helps you to be able to set up um, everything that you need to set up. And one of the other great features about this platform also is, let's say maybe you're stuck and you don't know how to proceed. If you just click here where it says send a message, you actually are able to reach out to the customer support and then they'll be able to get back to you during working hours. As you can see at the time I'm actually recording this, they're just gonna ask for your name, your email address, you type in your message and then they'll get back to you. But normally if they are online, they can actually instantly start helping you to uh, just by answering whatever questions you might have. So building a website is as simple and as easy as that. This is the software that I personally use. I've used many other softwares before, but currently at the moment, this is the best software that I have found online. It's the most affordable software and it's what I use to build all my websites. Now, if you want me to personally help you to actually set up your own website, there's gonna be a link in the description below that you can click on and you'll be able to book a call with me, depending on what type of help you need. If you just simply need me to um, just show you a few tips and tricks, you can sign up for a 10 minute call with me there. But if you actually want me to build your website for you, for your business, there is that option. But obviously it's going to cost um, something and you can find the details uh, there. Please make sure you smash the like button just to show your support. It helps me to get the algorithm to show this video to as many people as possible. And make sure that you subscribe and hit the bell notification so that you'll be notified every single time I create content uh, just like this, designed you to uh, make progress or to get results online. You also might be interested in checking out this other video here, which will show you how to start your own web design business or your web design uh, agency, whereby you'll be able to make money by simply building websites for other people using this very software that I've just shown you. If that's something that you're interested in, check out this video. But otherwise, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.